Instead of a mother with no option but to let her baby die and then go home, right in this place, we have an opportunity for her to give her child life, a home and redemption. This very ground, 85 acres of land already purchased for the Sanctuary of Hope is where my father's lifelong dream of bringing the gospel to all generations will take place. I worked as an assistant athletic director at the DePelchin Faith Home in Houston, Texas, one of the largest orphanages and one of the most splendid facilities uh, for children trying to rebuild their lives I've ever been around. I was privileged in the time that I was there to see life through the eyes of an orphan. Every Friday was a visitation day. And the little guys, the orphans, would boys, would tell each other, this Friday my dad's coming to see me. My mother's going to come get me. They'll be driving a big new car, da 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 And then they would go and hang on the cyclone clone fence waiting, and no one would come. Week after week after week, and then it dawned on them, I'm by myself. I'm alone. But there are children in our country that desperately need help. And while we can't help all of them, we can help some of them. And because we can, we should. And because this is the commission of God, we are. I know that we cannot change the world. I know that it is an ocean of need, but it is wrong to see a need and not try to meet that need to the level that God helps you. It is a monumental task, but the need has been staring right at us for decades, and we do have the determination to change the world one beating heart at a time. All it takes is vision, which John Hagee has always had. All it takes is his type of courage and tenacity fortified in decades of building upon God's Word. All it takes is fresh energy to find sanctuary for our future generations. Sanctuary of hope. That all God's children are given a chance to survive. Hope to save those who can then become our future leaders. All it takes is hope for our world to come. All it takes is our generation doing what must be done for the next generation. All it takes is hope and you. I'm asking each of you to join me in this holy mission of saving the children of America. There's a Jewish proverb that says, he who saves one life saves the world. The first step is saving the physical lives of these children. Planned Parenthood offers a death sentence. Sanctuary of Hope offers a life sentence. America is killing approximately 4,000 babies a day in our tax-funded abortion mills. When an unwed mother finds herself pregnant, she deserves a choice to save her baby's life. The Sanctuary of Hope will offer that choice. A child deserves a loving home where they can be nurtured and developed to become a productive citizen. I need your help. There are thousands of young women searching right now for a solution to their pregnancy. Let's give them the choice of life. Jesus said, I have come to bring life and life more abundantly. I want you to make the most generous contribution you can. Together, we can change the world one life at a time. I'm counting on you to join me in this holy mission to save innocent lives in America. Thank you.